Meet Benjamin, a.k.a. Benny. He's a two-year-old sable masked ferret. I start off by clipping his very long, sharp nails so that I don't get scratched while I'm grooming him. Typically, ferrets are very wiggly animals, but Benny is very used to getting groomed, so he sits still like a good boy. Next, I clean out his ears, and based on the look of pure bliss on his face, I'd say he's enjoying how that feels. I'm bathing him using a very mild oatmeal shampoo. Ferrets have a natural musky odor to them, and bathing them too frequently or using too harsh of a shampoo can actually cause them to stink worse. For that reason, Benny only gets bathed about once every three months or so. But if he had it his way, it'd be more often because this boy loves his baths. I have found that the most efficient way to get off all the excess water after a ferret's bath is to wring them out like soaking wet dish rags. Benny's favorite part of getting groomed is playing peekaboo while I towel dry him. He's a very playful little guy and he never misses an opportunity to have a little fun. He's a very unique little fella and happily lies down and relaxes as he gets dried. I've owned and groomed many ferrets in my lifetime and Benny's the one and only ferret that I've ever personally met that genuinely loves the dryer. Most ferrets and dogs least favorite part of grooming is the dryer. This guy is one of a kind. Once I'm done drying him, I brush him using a soft brush. I would prefer to use a rubber curry glove on him, but he doesn't like it very much and prefers this brush. And with a face as cute as his, of course he always gets his way. He is done and being this adorable is just so exhausting. So now he's ready to go take a nice long nap. Benny's hoping that if you enjoyed his video, you give him a big thumbs up and in return, he'll give you a nice big kiss. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe.